All right, welcome aboard, folks. If you've made it this far, it means you're still alive and you're ready to complete page two. Page two is, I think, a little more fun, but it does help us practice and it does have a lot of information on vocabulary. So the directions really, it just says click on the Google Classroom link to start. So I'll have the link here in Google Classroom for you to click. And I'll also make sure that um, this video kind of helps you know how to kind of get through the activity, what the website looks like, what the activity generally looks like. And as long as you just follow along, uh, it should be pretty straightforward on how to complete it. Unless it's a little over uh, two pages, so don't fret. You just want to do steps one through nine all together. Make sure you end up writing all your information here as well. I'm going to help you kind of just get started and get used to how to use the simulation. It says step one says you want to move to the choose your challenge menu. Let's do that now. So I click the link and I'm at the website and it's of course titled Cell Defense and we want to start a new game. It says press spacebar or click here to continue and I'll hit the spacebar because very few games even allow you to do that. So, all right, it says choose your challenge. So we've gotten that far. It says choose your challenge. It says from the menu, choose build a membrane. So just like you expect, right? So you just click build a membrane. It says Dr. Vile has a vile weapon that destroys plasma membranes. Oh no. It says without blank, cells of living things will die because they are unable to maintain blank. So let's kind of see what the structure of uh, these activities look like. It says without the blank, so there we go, that's our first uh, vocab uh, fill in the blank. It says the cells of living things everywhere will be unable to maintain blank homeostasis, homeostasis and will die. Plasma membrane and homeostasis are both vocab words for us, so that fits in uh, just great. So this activity just kind of gives us a better chance to use some of the language. So without, and right here you would type cell membrane, cell, or sorry, plasma membrane. So without the plasma membrane, cells of living things will die because they're unable to maintain, that's right, homeostasis. Now that you kind of see, a lot of these blanks will be answered as you go through the simulation. So as you click, you know, you know, it says click here to continue. It'll keep going forward and forward and forward, and it'll always give you information up here to use. Uh, to better understand, uh, especially when they're filling the blanks. That's just how uh, the person who made the worksheet uh, designed it. So they'll always give you background information. Use that background information as you move throughout this activity to fill in blanks like you can see here. So it just keeps going in that, in that same style, right? Uh, step two, it does ask you to draw a phospholipid in the box. So whatever the phospholipid looks like, I mean, we've learned that lipids are a type of polymer, so, but it does want you to draw one phospholipid in the box. And then you just keep moving through. It says what two molecules easily pass through the membrane. You can draw or write them here, uh, molecule one and two. And then when you get to step six, you can draw or write each of these molecules that were not easily passing through the membrane. All right, good luck, and I hope you enjoy the activity.